Hi, I'm Teniola Shiboale. Here's your Channel's TV news update for November the 9th, 2021. President Mohamed Buhari has arrived in Paris, the French capital, for an official visit as a guest of President Emmanuel Macron, according to a statement by presidential spokesperson Femi Adishino. The president's plane landed in the country at 2.45 a.m. President Buhari is also expected to attend the three-day Paris Peace Forum, scheduled to hold from November the 11th to the 13th. After joining for three weeks, the Senate and the House of Representatives resume plenary today, passing the harmonized version of the Electoral Act Amendment Bill. They approved electronic transmission of results and direct primaries. Earlier, the Senate condemned what it describes as an invasion of the residents of Justice Odili. They mandated the Inspector General of Police to make public the outcome of investigations into the invasion of her residence. Meanwhile, a retired Air Force officer, Air Vice Marshal Mohamed Maisaka, has been killed by gunmen suspected to be bandits in Rigasa area of Igabi local government area of Kaduna State. Maisaka, who is also the chief medical director of MSK Hospital in Rigasa, was murdered in his residence alongside his grandson. Although the identity of his killers is not yet clear, residents said the attack could be a clear case of assassination. The Kaduna State Police Command has also confirmed the incident. On the international scene, at least 26 children aged between 5 and 6 burned to death on Monday when their straw and wood classrooms caught fire in southern Niger seven months after a similar tragedy in the capital, Niamey. The mayor of Maradi City told reporters that 26 children died and 13 others were injured. Niger, one of the poorest countries in the world, has tried to fix shortages of school buildings by constructing thousands of straw and wood sheds to serve as classrooms, with children sometimes sitting on the ground. Super Eagles goalkeeper Maduka Okoye has joined English Premier League outfit Watford FC. Okoye joined the English club from Dutch side Sparta Rotterdam and was signed on a five and a half year deal which is scheduled to begin on January the 1st, 2022 when the transfer window opens. The transfer fee was undisclosed. And that's the news update. Don't forget to join us tomorrow for fresh updates. I'm Tenyola Shoboale. Thanks for watching.